I got some more stuff yet again, and this time I got a brand new PlayStation 3 game. The new God of War, called God of War Ascension. You can't see it very well, but, you know. It's, this is a prequel to the main series. This is, like, after he killed his family, but before he, like, swore off against Ares, and... I haven't seen the full game, but... Front Steven ain't too bad. The combat's really different. It's also much more challenging. I can't believe how much challenging it is. And it's got a new multiplayer mode, which may or may not be tacked on, but I never experienced it. I've just been playing too much of this game, and I gotta say, this game is fucking awesome. They said it's really short, but it's it's got high replay value. It's get it, it's it's an awesome game. I haven't been playing this game much, but you know I'll get into it someday. And I got new Blu-ray movies recently. My grandparents gave me my birthday money, and it was better late than ever, but there's one movie. But before I bought movies about my birthday money, I got Blu-ray. I got this movie called Deliverance, and I heard it's a classic film, and it's very controversial, and because there's this rape scene, it's so graphic that poor, it ruined, it, poor, it traumatized poor Ned Beatty, who is a Louisville native actor. And I just feel sorry for you, Ned Betty. But I'm 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 gonna watch this movie someday because I heard it's really good. I heard it's disturbing, but it's really really good. I'm gonna give it a shot. And I bought two anime films that are absolutely incredible. First of all, I got Who Framed Roger Rabbit 25th Anniversary Blu-ray. I'm gonna say this right now. The only complaint I have against this Blu-ray is. There is no new features at all. It's basically all ported from the Disney, from the Buena Vista, Vista series. But other than that, this, this Blu-ray is excellent. It's got improved sound and audio, and video. I mean, this is who Frank, it's Roger Rabbit for Christ's sake. You, this, this is live action mixed with animation. And this movie is just fucking incredible. You have to, this is a must own, especially at a price I paid. I paid 20 bucks at Walmart. This is, this is an excellent Blu-ray. Last but not least, as a video game fan, I finally got a really, really, really kick-ass film. And believe it or not, it's not done by Pixar, but by Disney themselves. That is called Rocket Ralph. This movie is just simply incredible. The storyline's excellent. The characters are excellent. And there's so many video game icons in this game, and I mean, in this movie. I don't know why I call it a game, but this is quite possibly the absolute best video game movie ever made. It should have won an Academy Award for Best Animated Film, but you know how the Academy is. They they love to kiss all, they kiss Pixar's ass, and I can't really gripe about it because Brave was actually a good movie. But this is an excellent film. If you're a video game fan, if you're an animation fan, period. You have to get this. The voice acting is really excellent. Especially Sarah Silverman who plays this adorable little girl from the kart racer. She's just amazing in this, in this role. And it, it, this is quite possibly one of the best films on this side. Toy Story 3 and and How to Train, Train Your Dragon and a bunch of other stuff. This is an excellent movie. That's all the stuff I reviewed. That's all the stuff I have to talk about this time. Till next time, bitches. Oh, and uh, one more thing. If you don't buy this game just because it's not a real stealth Metal Gear game, you're a fucking idiot. That's all I got to say about that. This game's awesome. It's awesome!